fish. And then I'm just gonna go to sleep because um there's really nothing else to do at this point. Because um the wheat's still growing, everything's still growing, and I will go to sleep. Up early the next morning, the wheat is still growing. Uh, not really hungry or anything, so I'm just gonna go back to sleep. Don't be stupid. I don't even have a remote amount of tired me. I'm not even gonna think about sleeping for some reason. But these nets haven't caught anything, so there's just so many of them. Just a clam in that one. <gasps> just some seaweed in this one. I think I might actually be over pushing. Could be a problem. So I don't see any bubbles. Never mind, there's some right in front of me. I'm going to do a little bit of fishing until I have some tiredness, and then I'm going to go back to sleep. Come to think of it, I'm going to actually come up under the ocean and see what the fish are doing. I kind of want to know how much fish there is. Doesn't seem to be all that much. Although the seaweed tells me that there is, there should be some fish. <gasps> so it's a good sign, I mean, I'm not finding nothing. So I'm off on shore, I'm going to drink some water. And um, I actually knew someone who was, um, someone who got me to play stranded in the first place. What he did was he actually went down underwater and harpooned the fish he wanted to catch with spears. But he said he was too lazy to use bow nets. And that just sounds crazy to me. So I'm just like, bow nets are the pinnacle of laziness. But he thought otherwise. He thought it was more interesting. And I kind of agree with him. It would be more interesting to do that. But I have all this cooked fish, so I'm mindful of it. So there goes all my hunger. Fish, yum yum, problem solved. This is a fish, which I will cook. Another fish. Oh, not salt water. I want the boat net. A clam, useless. Unless I get a pearl, and I don't really know what those do either. So, to be figured out. And here we have another fishing net that also caught a fish. And I believe I should have five fish in there. I should be all set. I'm just going to catch some more fish until I get tired once again, and then I'm going to continue growing the grain. I will make the grain into paste and then dough. And from there, it's really, I don't know what, what's going to happen once I get the bread ready. So I might actually stop the recording. We will see what happens in the next few days. Um, I'm kind of getting bored as well, and if you guys are getting bored, and I'm getting bored, then we shall see. And I'm just going to go to sleep, and then I'm going to end the recording for the moment. I will commence recording once I have gotten a sufficient amount of wheat, which will get me a certain amount of bread, etc., etc., etc. So right now, that's what I'm going to do. Actually, I'm going to actually plant a bonus plump. We will see how long that takes to grow. I don't really know. But it should take a while. And then I'm going to get in my hut. I'm going to go to sleep. I'm going to end the recording for a moment. So I will see you guys. This is Shachatum out. Okay, guys, I'm back. And the week is all fully strong. Yay. Um... Although there isn't much to talk about at this point, um, harvesting the wheat, and um, I'll show you how much I got, I must have gotten a ridiculous amount, so I planted like 20 to start with, just over 60, which is a lot of wheat, more than I've ever, ever actually needed, more than this guy will ever need, I'll say that. I'm really happy I have this six. it's all I have. There's two more wheat over here.
So now I have all this wheat. I have 81. That is a lot. I'm rapid fire pressing my left mouse button because I'm using the trackpad so it sucks. But there it is, all 81 of it. Which is a lot of wheat. Put it together for some flour. So I have 12 flour added to the 4 I already have of dough. So I really only needed 3. I actually have more than enough. So I'm going to go with the well. I'm going to go and make... One moment. There we go. I will also put one of the girls with some bread. If I can keep it. That will be really useful later. I'm also going to make all of this. And this and I believe I need stone. That's it. Um, what do I need? Alright, I'm supposed to need this. Now I have 15 of this, which is enough to make me 15 bread. If I had enough space, which I don't. Once the ball you We'll get rid of that, and then we'll get rid of... Now I should have some space. We're cooking the bread. So I'm just gonna keep on. So this is 350, and this is also 300. So they're the same, actually. I thought they would weigh something different. So that is it for my bread cooking. I'm gonna talk to the sheep. You have not done all of them. You have to see and take care of five fish cups. There is not enough crops. So I just need to grow 10 wheat, obviously, because she doesn't seem to understand that berries are a crop. That's annoying. But I can do it. That's three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, front of your feet. Your big, ugly feet. I've done great service. We'll show it. Thankfully, we will build the ship with bad tidings. We have to say it's not workers to jetty. Workers of the sun become something impossible. The jetty is full of seaweed and algae. Settle on building destroy it all. Building not work. Work be useless. You must clean away the seaweed. Dive and destroy it. I need to do more. Oh, that's nice. We basically have to remove all of the seaweed in the water. Yeah. That will take a while. Yep, I can't just like pick it up. This thing does not want to get destroyed at all. Yep. It's just too stubborn. Wow. That is sick. Now I have like 15 CD and I don't really know what to do with it. So I'm gonna have to toss it. Maybe the sickle will come in. I'm diving down the hatch. And there should be a huge amount of CD. There it is. Lots of lots. Trying to dive, but I can't really. So it died. Now I'm going to go and get this seaweed. I'm going to destroy this seaweed. It will take a while, but it will get destroyed.
I will continue attacking this one. So there goes that seaweed. So there's another seaweed trapped under there. Ton of seaweed, 44 of it. Toss all of it on the ground. Let me see if I got any fish today. Yeah. Some clams, useless. Um, one moment. Alright. So, never mind. The one moment did not exist. But, um,. I have to wrap up the LP, which is depressing because, you know, I like doing this for you guys. But, um, it has to be done. And, well, it just has to be done, so... I will get off shortly. This will be episode probably somewhere in the high teens. I'm not really sure exactly how long, I just know it'll take a while. So that's more seaweed. It should be some. I'm gonna keep attacking the scene until it goes away. There's more seaweed. Even though I really don't need it. I'm gonna attack the barrel. Did I just get three greens? Wow. Three greens and some three puppets. Wow. Could've just done that on the entire time. I'm gonna actually cook over a fire some stuff. I cook some stuff over the fire, go to sleep, and I might be able to get rid of the rest of it. Left. Get rid of all of the seed. Luckily, I have this. If I didn't, I'd be Oh, right, duh. Tons of it. Then again, they are doing me a giant favor by getting me off the fire. So there's another seaweed. I'm gonna destroy it with my skill. Now that I'm out of the water, out of everything, I will return to my lovely shelter and go to sleep. Still with my thing in hand. My sickle. Right. So I'm gonna head into this tent. Oh. That would have been very helpful. No. That can actually pick up the tent. I don't really need to fish this. Um, let's see, see these. <gasps> so right there is another one of those pesky seeds. <gasps> So actually, I'm going to get off right now, so I will actually see you guys in the next episode of Stranded 2. Stay tuned.